Hi, meteorologist TJ Del Santo with the latest on Hurricane Lee. Lee still out there in the Atlantic, moving northward about nine miles an hour, beginning to pick up a little steam, I think. Um, we are looking at a Category 2 storm now, and still holding its own out there, in the, out there in the Atlantic. So Lee is expected to continue northward, kind of zigzagging a little bit, and passing off to our south and east. Uh, over the next uh, 24, 48 hours, perhaps as a Category 1 storm east of Chatham sometime on Saturday morning. Uh, we'll be seeing, I think, some rain from Lee, but I think the bigger story might be with the winds. We're looking at some winds by Saturday morning, 40 to 50 miles an hour across parts of Rhode Island and southeastern Mass. But look out the Cape and Islands, 65 to 70 mile an hour wind gusts possible early on Saturday. I am concerned about uh, some of the trees toppling, especially uh, central northern Rhode Island, where we have seen a lot of rain over the last couple of weeks. Uh, those trees could easily come down because the ground's just so saturated. So kind of keep that in mind. Could be some power outages on uh, Friday night and into Saturday morning, but the winds will begin to ease a little bit on um, Saturday afternoon and evening. Let's track Lee hour by hour forecast. You can see it working its way northward. Now, in terms of rain, at least in this computer model, other computer models kind of support this as well. Not a whole bunch in the way of rain for us as Lee passes off to our east and then making landfall somewhere eastern Maine and Atlantic Canada. But uh, yeah, we are expecting uh, Lee uh, to uh, produce uh, some wind and a little bit of rain here in southern New England. We'll be keeping a close eye on Lee. We have tropical storm watches in effect for our area. All the information coming up on 12 News This Morning.